Hi everyone, Liz here. Thanks for stopping by. So, I've just had a parcel delivered from Amazon and we'll get into it and have a look, see what it is. It feels diamond painting size. So, let's see what we've got. Okay, it's empty. Right, I did have a quick sneaky peek at one to see uh, which company they were from and to make sure that they were diamond paintings. Uh, and yes, they are. So let's have a look. So these are from Ant King, which I have used before. And it looks like we are special drill paintings. So let's get into it and have a look. Oops, not wanting to open. Get rid of the plastic. Alright. So, oh, this is pretty. Oh, that is really pretty. So we have a lovely flower um, display in like a frame. And they're beautiful springy yellowy colours with like a pale green background. That really will make a good picture. Yeah, like that. Okay, we've got key codes top and bottom and there are nine different gems or colours on this one. We have a very basic toolkit with just looks like two or three little whip seal bags in there. So, but yeah, this looks pretty. All the crystal gems to do it with. Let's give it a quick squidge down. Get it flattened. And yeah, smashing the specials is on, so this could be another special drill picture to get done. They make very nice um, presents these, you know, rather than giving somebody fresh flowers. You could give them a picture instead, it'll last a little bit longer. Okay, lots of different colours on these. These leaves have got an awful lot of different colours and all this border. I do like it when they do a picture and it like spills over the border. It just sort of gives a different dimension, doesn't it, to the picture. But yeah, I love the colours, really happy colours. Okay, so let's measure it. Um, I doubt the actual picture size, the bit where you would put it into the frame is 24 centimetres, which is nine and a half inches by uh, 34 centimetres, 13 and a quarter inches. So, yeah, you're losing about your five, six centimetres around your edge. But looks like a nice picture. Quite a good one to do. Uh, just an evening's little project to sit and do. And I do like my special drills. Um, I do like the way that they, you know, if you've had a, a busy day and you just want to achieve something. And they do work up really quickly. Okay, let's get into this one. More crinkly packets. Okay, so let's have a look at these gems. I think they're all going to be greens and yellows. Oh, we've got a few different ones. So we've got a darker green and a very palish green and like a brownie bronzy colour. And oh, that's a nice pop of green. And then a darker green and a yellowy gold. Oh, an orange. So we've got orange in the middle. And then we've got some little gold teardrops and some little green teardrops. So very pretty, like that one. Okay, so that's just one of my little pictures that I got. I did use coupons on these. And they were Vipon coupons. <laughs> Um, they did say that these were supposed to be £22.89 and pence each, these paintings. And I got the two of them for £18.77. and So they were still among the higher price range. Um, but yeah, there's no way I would have paid nearly £23 for one of these. I do sometimes think that they inflate the prices to then bring them down again. But uh, yeah, I mean, I don't mind paying what I've paid for it. It looks like a nice quality canvas and nice drills there. So let's have a look at the next one. I do believe they're supposed to be a matching pair, these. I think that's why I ordered the two, because they were both sort of a similar thing. So let's see if they are. Okay, I could be totally wrong. <laughs> it has been known on... Uh, Lots 
of occasions. Oh, they definitely don't want me to get into these. Oh, for goodness sake. Where is it? This one, let's uh, unfurl it. And oh, these look all different pinks and things. These are a definite different colour palette. Exactly the same toolkit with the, yep, yeah, there's definitely three little grip seal bags in there. And oh, this one's pretty. Oh, it goes that way. <laughs> ah, right. So the only thing that's similar is the fact that it's got a frame on it, but this one is offset with more flowers down at the bottom. It's, oh, it is one of the quill. I was gonna say it's similar to one of the quilling pictures, um, but this one actually is because you can see where it would have had the paper quilling shapes just on here uh, and some of it around here. So yeah, these are like the uh, paper quilling ones that uh, are quite popular at the moment. So this one has uh, 14 different colors and shapes. And I like the fact that it's like, a scalloped edge there with um like a flowery scalloped edge with like a, i don't know it's like the wall coming through at the edge there and then we've got a little bit of extra decoration there as well so yeah quite nice this like this just that little bit different i don't know if you can see yeah it's got a scalloped edge but it does say look like it's like part of the wall or the background or whatever coming through so it's not just the frame You've got that extra added detail as well. And this little bit on this corner here. Mm. Okay, let's get it flattened down. Those will be going in my little folder to get flattened because I can uh, think of a couple of people I would like to give these to as presents, actually. And we are coming up uh, in the UK. We have our Mother's Day in March. So we are coming up to our Mother's Day next month. So it's something to be thinking about for presents and cards for Mother's Day. I think um, elsewhere in the world you have your Mother's Day in May. But to say the UK we have ours uh, in March. Okay, quick measure. I think it will be the same size as the other one, but we'll double check. Yep, 24 that way, which is nine and a half inches. Bye. Uh, 34 that way which is about 13 inches so yeah it's exactly the same size as the other so you could frame these and have them together um albeit they are very different color palettes i did think I, but i suppose well even the green isn't really the same is it so yeah never mind okay so let's have a look at these drills because um of the colors that i like i do prefer this one because it's pink <laughs> pink girl at heart okay so let's have a Ooh, there's all sorts of specials in this one there's quite a few different ones so we've got two packets of your plain silver have a lovely cherry red and a great pink there like a peachy orange and a slightly paler red and that lovely green i love that green where it's just taking away the darkness of it and you just get the light through it a very pale pink uh, a yellowy gold, and that's like a darky browny bronze, hot pink, hot pink, hot pink. Oh, and look at those, look at those, we've got little pink flowers, oh, we've got little pink flowers. And then we've got some long thin marquees in the silver, and they have um, an AB coating on them, that's your iridescent coating. And then we've got some hot pink with iridescent coating, wow. And then some large faceted pink round gems, which are number 14, which is the red one. <gasps> and we only need one. And they've sent us three. Yay! I've got two spare. <laughs> I don't know what I'm going to do with all these gems, but uh, I just sometimes get them out and look at them. I am sorting out my spare uh, gem storage, so... Once it is fully sorted, I will let you see it. Okay, let's just pop these away into their little packet. 
right so just a quick video today of the two pictures we have whoops the lovely yellow flowers with the beautiful green leaves in the background and all the background in the pale green and then we have the more vibrant and uh, pinks and reds there very very pretty okay well i hope you've enjoyed uh, just seeing these with me if you have a thumbs up is always much appreciated that's the little button just down here if you've got any comments or questions pop them in the comments down below and if you want to come back and see what i get up to next if you press that subscribe button and the little bell next to it you'll be notified when my next videos come out so thanks ever so much for stopping by and I do hope to see you all again soon. Bye for now.